Authorities say contact tracing is one of the keys to stopping the spread. The state and Marion County claim they're tracking down three out of every four people who have tested positive for COVID-19. CBS 4's Russ McQuaid finds out how their system is working. The contact tracing that we have, I would probably say that on the whole, we're probably reaching at least about 80% of them on a successful level. So what exactly is involved in contact tracing? If I went and tested positive, I get reported to the state as a positive case. Their contact tracer contacts me, gets my general information, and who I have been in contact with within a recent period of time. In the last week, the Indiana State Department of Health has expanded its daily data dashboard. It now shows a bigger statistical picture of the pandemic in Indiana and helps experts predict where it's going. The contract tracing process helps these numbers. So when there's a pretty high success rate, like 77 or 80 percent of contacts um, being captured and, and contacted by the health department, that means that those individuals then have the opportunity, right, a recommendation and the opportunity to be tested for the disease. Through the contact tracing, I think we're starting to see a pattern that a lot of the spread is happening in kind of group settings. That's where that that contact tracing we were talking about becomes so critically important and the honesty on the part of the person that tested positive to say, well, you know, I attended my nephew's senior open graduation open house and here's who was at that that I'm aware of and then working it that way. But if as far as you, you know, you and I stopping and talking to each other on the corners, we walk the dog or whatever, the, the interaction is going to be or the, the risk of exposure is rather limited. Even in the enclosed environment, like going shopping at the grocery store, even if we pass each other in the aisle, as long as we're both wearing our masks and we're not lingering, having lasting conversations at arm's distance, I think we're doing okay. Marion County's daily positive test rate result stands at an average of about 9.4 percent. Experts say to really get a handle on the disease, that rate needs to come down to 5 percent. Russ McQuaid, CBS 4 News.